guys! So today we will be doing a project called Song Exchange. In this project, two of our Zoom instructors who are extremely different from each other will exchange songs then choreograph to the song that was given to them. Later, both of our instructors will react to each other's choreography and give their opinion on what they've learned from watching each other's interpretation of the music. So for today, we have Victor and Eugene. Victor is our Latin instructor and Eugene is our choreography class instructor. Okay, so the song that I chose for Eugene is Queen Como Tu. <laughs> I don't know if I said that right. It's a Spanish song that is actually in the rumba category. The reason why I chose this song is because I wanted to like push his limits because I know Eugene is a person who is like very articulate. He's like But this time I wanted to see like when it's something slow and it's like a song about love and romance and it's a girl, a girl singing I want to see how much he struggles. <laughs> that is the reason why I chose this song for him. I'm shocked. Um, like I said, this song I chose for Eugene is a song that you hear at competitions for ballroom dancing. So when I saw him like have those, you know, he had footwork which was from the Latin background, but then he also added his new style swag, and I think I, he literally captured every single beat that was in the song. I didn't even hear the beats <laughs> that you captured. I was like, oh my gosh, that was so genius. Eugene, everybody. I was like, what is this? <laughs> like, what? I don't even know what's the meaning. I don't even know like what, what she's singing. Okay, but it's like, I choreograph based on how she sings, like the tone of her voice and then the, the background music and stuff. So I just go along without thinking much and just uh, like do what I, what I always do to a song that I don't even know. Yeah, yeah. If you ask me if it's more difficult, uh, I would say 50-50 because like I never uh, heard it before. Like naturally I won't have any expectations so I just have fun with it. Yeah. Uh, versus the song that I already know, then I will tend to think a lot more. Yeah, so this is actually really really fun. Really fun. So yeah. Uh, yeah, thank you so much for choosing this song. For me. Thank you, Eugene, for like yeah. choreographing the heck out of that. That was amazing. So yeah. yes, first challenge done. <laughs> I chose Pay Me by Lion Air. Yeah, like same thing. It's a popular song in the competition and uh, it's a song that I personally love it a lot. Like because of like its uh, intricate musicality, uh, heavy beats, yeah that's what I like. So and because uh, Victor is like super good at what he's doing so I want to kind of put him in a spot where he has to do what he does with a song that is like totally out of his uh, element and I want to see how he be able to fuse that together yeah so I'm excited yeah. oh my gosh. <laughs> 
pounds, give me dollars, give me francs, yeah, straight to the bank, yeah. fuck those things, cause the product is a thing, yeah, mellow maniac, call me Wolfgang, yeah, used to be a roller, but now I want a real gang, ain't no way around it, sign a check and pay, they don't really miss my name in every rent, now they looking for my name in every place, these labels won't sign me, man, what a cliche, no discussion, yeah. no introduction, yeah. <laughs> so, did not expect this at all. How do you even fuse Latin with hip hop music? You know, but it's fresh to watch. Personally, because I I, I took your class twice, mm. and I know how difficult it is, like for the technique and stuff. He just kill it. He just nailed it. Um. My first expectation, when I first heard the song, I was freaking out. I literally looked at Eugene, I was like, I hate you. Like, <laughs> it's a song that I'm not, like, when, I know, like, I joke around, like, when you think of Victor, you think hip-hop. But, like, I didn't think it was going to be that hip-hop. Like, it's very out of my element, but I appreciate you for challenging me. Because, honestly, this is the fun of this challenge, is the fact that we have to put each other out of our comfort zones. Yeah. And I think that was the hardest thing for me, knowing that, you know, hip hop is one of the stars that I really want to work on. And you gave me such a strong, like, hefty, like, raw, swag, swag song. And, you know, with a Latin background, I'm like, what do I do with this? So then I thought, okay, you know what? I'm going to put my own spin on it. And the thing is, like you said, it's sort of like I didn't have any expectations. I didn't know what I was expecting to come out of it. So I had so much fun in the process in just making something, feeling the music, listening to the musicality. And the thing that I found out is that hip hop beats, salsa beats, they're very similar. Mm. Like there's a very close interest, intricacy between them. And that was sort of the turning point where I realized that, you know, Dance is all intertwined, mm. and there's always like influence from this and influence from that. So, yeah. Yeah. I appreciate you for giving me that song, even though I cried in my heart <laughs> and I cried in my soul. But I was like, yeah, let's show a masculine-ish side of Victor and just dance and have fun. So yeah, challenge well accepted. Yeah. So thank you so much, Victor. Thank, thank you, you, Eugene. Thank you. And that was our first challenge. Done and dusted. <laughs> Thank you guys for watching the video. We hope that you enjoyed it and stay tuned for the other instructors. <laughs>